In this course, you will learn more than 20 plus IT support fundamental frequently asked questions and answers just like this. What serves as the bridge between the RAM and the CPU or central processing unit? The correct answer is the memory controller chip or MCC is a bridge between the CPU and the RAM. A memory controller is a digital circuit that manages the flow of data going to and from a computer's main memory. Then you will learn 50 plus computer networking frequently asked questions and answers. Please take a look. What are the seven layers of the OSI model? The correct answer is the Open Systems Interconnection Model is a conceptual framework that divides network communications functions into seven different abstraction layers, which are the physical layer, the data link layer, the network layer, the transport layer, the session layer, the presentation layer, and the application layer. Then you will learn 30 plus quiz questions about operating systems. Here is a clip to have an idea. What are the main command line interfaces for Windows, Linux, and Mac OS? The correct answers are, as of today, the most popular operating systems and their command line interface names are, for Windows OS, Command Prompt and PowerShell. For Linux OS, Bash or Born Again Shell. For Mac OS, Terminal. Then you will learn 10 plus systems administrations frequently asked questions and answers just like this. What are some of the most popular directory services protocol used today? And the correct answers are, here are some popular directory services protocols. Lightweight Directory Access Protocol, LDAP. This is the most popular directory services protocol for cloud and web applications. It provides a standard way for communication between directories and directory clients. Active Directory. Microsoft's Active Directory is the most commonly used directory service today. Users say that it is secure and easy to use. Kerberos. This is the most common authentication protocol in use today. It is designed around the concept of using tickets to provide access to network resources. Then you will learn 25 plus IT security frequently asked questions and answers of today in IT support. Please take a look to have an idea. Question eight. An attacker uses software that continuously tries different combinations of characters to gain access to something password protected. What kind of attack is this? And the correct answer is a brute force attack. A brute force attack tries out every possible combination of characters to guess the password. Hi, I'm MD Diallo. I'm the owner of this course. I'm certified Google IT support, Google project management, Google data analytics with engineering background. And this is my IT support quiz course with my personal notes. So this course is largely inspired from the Google IT support certificates. As next steps after completing this course, if you didn't do it yet, please go get your Google IT support certificate. Also go get your Quantia A plus and Network Plus certificates. This course is a partnership with other co-instructors. So you will only see me in very few videos to congratulate you and at the end of the course. But if you have any questions or need help, feel free to reach out to me at onlinecompisschool at gmail.com. So shall we begin? Let's get started. Enjoy your new skills and have a great course journey.